So yeah, here I am back on the road again. Separated for uh, over two years now and I haven't even attempted to try to mess around with people, which is kind of crazy. Considering I still think I got, you know, a little flavor going on. But um, the truth is that it's more important things like getting my life together at a whole other level. Financially, that is. My relationship with my children was pretty good. Actually, probably better than I had in a long time. And, um, you know, I, I really have a lot of major goals to accomplish. And what I mean by that is that um, I have the dojan. Now, the dojan is a place where people can literally increase their knowledge of martial arts skills and business skills, fear martial arts, and um, secrets, history, comedy. A lot of good things, you know? But, um, the truth of the matter is that, you know, here we go again. Here we go again. I believe in you. Your grandfather, your father, your son, your friend, your karate instructor, your mentor, your variety of things. And you've also been really good at making excuses. And I know that that's not what the goal is any longer. Yes, I'm talking to me. Sometimes these are the best conversations you can ever have. When you're highly trained, you've been uh, made the seminars, you've given seminars, you have walked the fire, jumped out of planes, won world championships, started businesses, closed businesses, help other people with their businesses. And, um, and that's just what starts. So when it's all said and done, I believe in you. GM. Real sport karate instructors. That was some hot news too. We did seminars as far as England with that and Puerto Rico, plus in the United States. We're certified instructors. And other people never even thought about that. You actually did it. Against all odds, even though you was a teenage pregnancy child with no education, you know, you made it to the eighth grade, never out of the ninth grade. He was a father at age 17, and in spite of that, while your father was incarcerated, you still became an internationally known competitor. Marshall uh, School owner with over a thousand students at one time, including in Midtown Manhattan, with the name and lights on Broadway. So you always had an attitude. Now in recent years, after becoming a manufacturer of clothing for things that's sold again all over the world with no education whatsoever when it comes to that industry he was able to flourish for many years and that's getting ready to launch a whole other level this time but with your son who happens to work for a major corporation in the apparel industry retail to be exact so how is it that the best is not yet to come of course it is you know, now you make technology seem simple. You don't have to wait for somebody to do it for you. You can do it yourself. And you're still pretty good at motivating other people. However, I think you must focus on the strategy you had when you were younger. Write it down. If you plan to fail, you fail to plan. Know what you want. Have a plan. And a success coach. Take consistent action, review your progress, and review your goals. I love you. God bless. Whoever's watching this, you're getting insights of my so called self talk. I believe in me. I believe that God gives you the gift of life. What you do with your life is your gift back. And I don't want to give them junk. God bless. ABC.